It's time, time for Sheen Extend, Extend TV. TV. Good job getting this far, everyone. We're nearing the last leg of the adventure, so keep it up. Oh, I mean, I'm sorry. I like how the AI is just not really playing with him anymore. Hey, Doctor. Why don't you tell us what that mission is already? Keep this up and everyone will finish at the same time. But I want to leap ahead at the last second. You're that guy who says, let's all run together and betrays his friends at the last second, huh? Pretty much. <laughs> Very well. I'll explain for the sake of the Garage Kids, too. The goal of the new Humanity Restoration Mission is to create a new human race with a new world. I think the AI is rooting for us. A new world for new humanity. Or in other words, extended humanity. Are we becoming altered carbon now? Extended humanity? This is Mirai's first time hearing this, too. You see, you may not have realized this about the creatures roaming around Mani, but they're most likely Mani staff members who didn't fully turn into Cleone on the Day of Reckoning. What? But I thought creatures were defective human clones. Technically, creatures are the transitional state between human and Cleone. But as humanity began turning into Cleone, for some reason, the Mani staff members stopped transforming before they fully changed. More research is required to find out exactly, but I'm certain these creatures were once Mani staff. Man, I think I wasted half your staff on the way here. They've continued surviving, as if affected by an anti-aging effect, and stopped aging completely. Resilient and unaging. Wouldn't you think they'd be considered the human race's true evolution? Sure. Let's just all be resilient, unaging, and walk around in circles saying the last two sentences we really knew over and over again. Staff has a lot of P. Diddies. Yeah, that's a little bit alarming. D don't tell me. Extended humanity is referring to creatures? I'm surprised we didn't run into any Karens. Just like, I want to see my manager. Show me your manager. No, creatures are definitely defects. However, this is why you don't trust the hard science conks with the future of the human race. They always pull shit like this. <laughs> Thank you for the bits, Claymore. Now you're gonna have to watch Alter Carbon. It's good! And that kind of sounds a little bit like what they're aiming for here. Question time! What? Why did Yosuke Kurosaki go around killing Sachika and other innocent people? Because he was a raging bag of murder dicks? Because a hashtag ugly sheep rode the train rocking hashtag exposed butt fashion? You're the jerk who posted that to social media? Question two. Why is it Haruto and the others are still suffering from the traumas of their past? Because you woke us up and made us relive them? Well, your, your kid did. Hashtag exposed butt fashion got 65,535 likes? Goddamn. My gosh! So many people saw it! And that's just the likes! I'm a little jealous. Show is apparently significantly better at social media than I am. I've been thinking about the answer to these two questions for a long time. Is it because of House White? The answer is because there's a bug in humanity. Well, I can't really argue with that. You just tried to say housewives, didn't you? The reason aberrant murderers are born, and the reason people are killed by these murderers, betrayal by superiors, stepsisters, brothers, fathers, mothers, teachers. Clearly, I just need to do some exposed about fashion. That's a fair point. None of it is anyone's fault. It's not the fault of the country, poverty, religion, or society. Oh, so we're just gonna conveniently eschew all accountability now. It's all because there's a bug built into the algorithm of the human mind. 
My time spent as an X key has only solidified my belief. I don't think a dude who spent the last however many years as a metal prosthetic really has any room to talk about humanity. This bug inside every mind is something that must be fixed so humanity can be perfected. Oh, I know! New humans with strong, unaging bodies like creatures and a flawless mind. So that's what extended humanity is. And we need Unit 1 to make it all come true. Well, this got very Nazi. You're half right. I kind of hope that was going to take off his hand. You got cut in half. But you get the idea, right? This is the goal of the new humanity restoration mission. Why is half of her still there this time? Okay, you guys. I have an announcement. This will be the last episode of Sheen Extend TV. Oh man, season two got canceled so fast. What? But we just started. No way. I moved to the city for this job. Eh, let's not. I'm getting bored of this. They're almost near the end, too. <laughs> I guess we have no choice if the doctor says so. Let's all cross that finish line together. Remember, kids. Illuminate. A new future. Not for humanity. Oh, God. Show is so on point right now. Hey. Bye-bye. And bye-bye. This wasn't the same after the old director quit. Yeah, man. All this fancy AI is just not quite the same as the, uh, the classic old writing styles. Are they waving? Or is that just the flickering? Okay, it's just the flickering. Oh man, can you imagine getting here and not having everyone alive? No turning back from this point. Hmm. Julie, do the thing. This seems to be the final door. Um, Extend machine unit one is in there. Presumably. I've only been in there a handful of times myself. Ah! Yeah, my stomach is feeling wonky from nerves. You guys go on ahead. What? Take care of it here. And do not forget to clean up after yourself. <laughs> yeah, I was not the only one who's nervous. Everyone else, including myself, feels the same way. Will we turn back to normal again? Is Dr. Terashima our enemy? We'll know the whole truth at last. Hmm? What's wrong, Sachika? Here! This. This is the place. It's behind this door. I recognize that smell. What? It smells pretty bad to me. Maybe it's Dr. Terashima's old man, B.O. Technically, he has no body, so that shouldn't be possible. Hey! Hey, careful, Sachika. You might be planning on taking over your body again. You think so? Dr. Terashima's smell? I don't know if that's it. Well. Let's go inside. We should find our answer there. It's fine. The eight of us have been through hell and back. We can take on anything. Let's go. Yeah, here we go. Oh boy. We open the door and search for the final truth. Descending through limbo to the land where the great mother sleeps. The who to what now? What? I'm assuming that means Luciora. Its appearance is completely different than that of the extend machines we've seen in the past. A storage tank looking glass tube in the center, and equipment squeezed into the narrow area. Countless cables connect to a device from the ceiling, and several mechanical arms folded at its sides. It looks nothing like an arcade cabinet and seems to be made from whatever they had on hand. For real? It's huge. So this is extend machine unit 01? Not what I was expecting at all. Can that thing really make a human clone? No, no, no. Maybe we've been too spoiled. See? Right to what we've been using. This looks much more like something that could make a clone. But, you know... But I can see what Rio is saying, too. When I hear Extend Machine, I picture the one we've been using. Obviously. Of course it's different from what you imagine. It wasn't called the Extend Machine until much later on. What is that? Dr. Terashima? 
<laughs> it's like those uh, segues with the video stands on top. The prosthetic arm hops out from behind Unit 1. This is... Originally, this butte was called the Santa Clara System. It was named after Sachika's mother, who gave herself up for the sake of clone research. Hmm. Oh, Santa Saint Clara. Uh -huh. The name was only changed to extend machine from Unit 2 on. In that case... So Sachika's mother was the creator of this machine? <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. That would be me. I'll show you. Unit 1, or rather Santa Clara version 1, is made with her organs and ovaries built into it. They were necessary for it to produce Utens. It may not look it, but it's a marvel of bioengineering. What did he just say? Made with her organs and ovaries? Don't tell me. Don't tell me Sachika's mother is... As someone who designs pipe systems, those low-hanging pipes and all the extra fittings are the scariest thing I've seen in this game. So many points of failure. Allow me to introduce... Clara Hirasaka, though she's no longer shaped like a human. Not at all. A boy, a mother's love sure is great, isn't it? She gave up her humanity for her daughter's sake. What? This is my mom? What? You turned her into part of a machine? No, could you? <laughs> she wanted that herself. Isn't that right, Mamoru? What? Why are you looking at me? No way. Dr. Mamoru, did you? Wait. No, I, I did hear that Sachika's mother was a casualty in all of this. Impossible. But I wasn't involved in the development of Unit 1. I only joined money after it was completed. Stop. Damn it, Dad, stop trying to confuse us. <laughs> oh, look at him desperately making excuses. Oh, my adorable fool of a son. The hell? Cut it out, asshole. You always use those words you know will hurt people. Aren't you Dr. Ichio and Sachika's father? Why can't you be kinder to them? Look. You know... I've shown them love in my own way. You just wouldn't understand, having no parents and all. What? Ow. Damn it. You. What do you plan on accomplishing with all this? Didn't I tell you on TV? The Shin Humanity Restoration Mission. I plan on restoring an extended humanity. Yeah, yeah. You can do whatever you like as long as it doesn't harm us. So? We only care if you can fix our aging effect. Of course. Certainly, Zen. All you have to do is give me your X keys. A new humanity. Next time you awaken, I guarantee you'll be a member of Extended Humanity. I don't want it. I'm not asking about this Extended Humanity bull. I just want to be normal again. In short, go fuck yourself. I have to admit I hadn't anticipated that a prosthetic army be the final boss of this game. It was a hell of a twist! Come on now. Oh, no can do, my friends. Rather. You ignored my warnings and came here, which means you're here to help with my mission, right? So it'd be very helpful if I had your X-keys. I do have Sachika's data, but the more samples, the better. What? What do you mean by that? Listen. I mean, I want the data regarding Cleone and creatures that have been collected in your X-keys. That's why I've been watching you all so closely. Also, I could gather data more efficiently. Huh? So then, we've been helping you with your data collection without knowing it this whole time? That's right. I turned the people of Mani into Cleone so I could gather data too. Uh, what? What? Did you just say you turned people into Cleone? Don't tell me. Wait, that was you? I thought Luciora went out of control because of anti-clone activists. Mm-hmm. Oh, they were part of it, yeah. Did you think I hadn't noticed what they were doing? Besides. And it never went out of control. They did what it was programmed to do. It was all according to plan. Huh? Uh, according to plan? That's right. Did you think the nanomachines would pacify themselves if they went berserk? It was calculated. What? What is he saying? Listen. It all began with President Renji Mashiro. Your dad, Yuma. He forced my hand by yapping about ending the clone research. So. I planned on telling him I'd start a bio or nano hazard within Mani and leak it to the world. That's why I planned on blackmailing him. I would have gotten plenty of Cleone samples too. Unfortunately. The only thing I hadn't accounted for was the outbreak spreading to the outside world. Huh? What? Like I said. Lucio's outbreak was originally supposed to be contained within Mani. I programmed it to die down up to 20 days past. Good grief. However, the anti-clone activists infected the machine's network with a virus. Wait a minute. 
Then on that day, why did you tell me to live on? Now then. Who knows? I'm only a backup, so I don't have memories of the original me. But... I have an idea, knowing how my own mind works. It must have come to me on a whim as a way of securing a helper for a data collection. This grand experiment is too difficult a task to accomplish as just a prosthetic arm, after all. Are you kidding me? Humanity was destroyed for that? Just for your research? No. I'll never let our executes end up in your hands. Claw, clamp, thing. Good grief. Uh, I guess I have no choice but to take them from you by force, then. <laughs> A pretty cliche line, but not bad. With that, Dr. Terashima turns his back toward Extend Machine Unit of One. Well, he doesn't really have a back, but that's what it looks like. Oh, yeah. I told you why I never extended myself up till now, haven't I? It's because I never had an Extend Machine compatible with my special X key. Like I said. That's why I came here. Unit One is the only one I modified for that purpose. Now, let's combine for real this time. My beloved Clara, your husband is home! I feel like I should have run back and auto-saved. Dramatic reenactment of the start of a Street Fighter tournament. Oh. What the? Rock'em sock'em! Show! We're not gonna be boxing other robots, you know? Wow, this is crazy! What's going on, Mirai? Unit 1 just got injected with Lucy Aura from Dr. Terashima's X-Key. And with the power of Lucy Aura, it's been upgraded into Unit 1 Plus. Uh... Show their eye, but how? <laughs> I put their AI into machines. It'd be interesting for this to end with them killing you. But we're supposed to kill Haruto and the others? I can't! I could never do that! Ah, but my hand is moving on its own! I wouldn't have a clip when it seals you to the final boss. It's gonna be Cleone Machine Voltron. I was joking! <laughs> They should leave. No point in engaging with some. Agreed. I like they can move from there. Ah, uh, don't be like that. Let's play. Otherwise, you'll die of starvation or old age anyway. What? Oh. Uh, sorry, everyone. I locked the door. You mean they can't leave this room until they beat us? Bastard, not bad for a piece of trash. You're wrong, Dr. Terashima. No research could be any more important than the lives of so many people. The reason you're so lonely is because you just don't understand that. Me? Lonely? <laughs> That's hilarious. Clone Sachi. You don't even try to understand people. That's why you want to create them yourself, isn't it? Even if you make the perfect human by yourself, you'll still be all alone. Humanity isn't infected with some sort of bug. We walk together because we're not perfect. They're talking and all I'm thinking is how fast can I switch everyone over to artillery mode? We accept all of each other's good and bad parts and walk hand in hand. Thanks for your valued opinion. But I've already found the parts I was missing. I'd like to see what lies beyond. That's what it means to be a scientist, isn't it? Now, your father will teach you that friendship, effort, and victory only work in manga. Nope, this is regular Sachika. Smart Sachika was a lie. She never existed. It was Terashima the whole time.
Um, I'm pretty sure it said come creatures, yes. It's, it's a great day to be old. Well, let's get at least a little bit more defense for some people, huh? Anyone's got points to spare is sinking them into middle age right now. Forgiven by, yes, fake actual sister. Yeah. It's not great. Anyone who's got points, I'm just sinking them in for the defense. Whatever we can get. It's not like it matters in this difficulty. We'll die in one shot anyways, but... I'll take whatever I can dig up. Uh, well, you know what? Going silver is crazy as a... No, it's not an option because we're not old enough for that. The fuck am I supposed to see that coming? I won't go easy on you. So this is the pain of giving birth. Stand down. Okay, yeah, I see uh Now, Clara. Okay, well let's let's hello. Fucking shadow men? Really? Fucking. Oh my god. There's fucking shadow men in here. Why are there shadow men in here? They seem to be either a little bit weaker or got smashed by something else. This is going to be deeply unpleasant. This is the impression I'm getting. I'm going to trade some people out so I can do a little bit of quick healing here. Okay, might be better to move as single person while I kind of figure stuff out, but since we have a bit of an opening here, I think... I think I'm gonna go for the guns. And, uh, just un unfucking load. Just unload as much as we can. Not, not bow for you. Thanks for the meal. I gotta split those out a little bit.
Pass everything around. As long as she can still move, it's good enough. Uh, no, not the gun. Shit. Put that bow back. I wonder if there's any way to make use of something like the extend machine. I got an idea. I wonder if I can switch it up so that the men are packing the melee weapons so I can use them to deal with the trash quickly. And uh, keep the ladies in artillery so I'm not bouncing stuff around. to the ladies. I'm tempted to send just solo Yuma to feel it out. How much defense does she have, actually, with all the bonuses she's got? I'm oh, gonna have to take off her good armor. She's still got 242. Shit, yeah, there are... Oh, God, there are tons of them. Okay. I think the machine closed itself up. Well, it buys us a moment, I think, to take a look around. Okay, there are traps. The question is, are any of those lined up to help me? And that looks like it could. Some of those are heading in the right direction. Well, while they're locked up like that, let's just get as... Let's figure out as much as we can here. Does not look safe at all. Okay, there's a couple of levers. Stones for tripping on. More levers. Hmm. to pull levers to get him to uh, show itself. Here's the various sonic traps. I gotta tell you, I do not want to get that close to it. Okay. I just have the worst feeling about all of this, you know? Is that just... Okay, there's nothing on the walls of that one. All right, well, I guess we might as well find out what the hell happens if we pull some levers, right? There. Here? Okay, looks like that activated a few things, trap-wise. 
question is, do I want to leave those on and try to stay down here? Uh, oh, please tell me, Yuma, do you have... Tell me she has floor trap resistance. Shit, she doesn't actually have floor resistance. No Zen does. Looks like Haruto does too. Not sound though. Haruto has sound and floor, so he might be the best one to be able to get through there. Hitting. So this is the pain of giving birth. As expected. Yeah. I won't go easy on you. Don't break Okay, so the girls can hurt him. Oh god. Oh shit, fear. Well fear just affects the Cleone, so we're, we're okay there. Cooking the machines fast. Traps are working for us. I gotta get the, uh, I gotta double check something on, uh, on her. I don't think she actually has the ammo. She wasn't shooting. The fuck did he come from? Uh, they said call creatures, so spawns were coming. Harto <laughs> leveling during this. Good lord. Take much to kill him, at least. They closed up. But it looks like there's still a shadow man or something out there. Not bad, right? All right, she can afford to carry more ammunition. That let's throw that to the back. Throw that to the back. Anything that's taking up real weight, let's get to the back. Uh, let's get these to the front. I think we got a room to kind of make adjustments. Fit a few more shells on her. Fuck it, take them all. Carry all of them. Rapid fire. You go, girl. So this is the pain of giving birth. All right, where are the creatures? Concentrate. Skip the Cleone. Let's just go straight for them. guys are doing this better. I don't want to waste ammo like that. That looks like potentially a shadow man. Yeah, that's a shadow man. Damn it. Shit. We did it. Waiting for my chance. They won't get away. Ah! I could use some more training. Huh. 
Huh, well. Not like he was doing much anyways, at least. Still. Ow. Dead Rio, not awesome. Not bad. Yeah, not sufficient. Okay, good. They did close up again. Make sure a few more arrows are passed up. Sorry, yo. That was my fault. Make sure people aren't hungry. Mostly just Yuma. Is there more? Not bad. But I don't want starvation to kick in in the middle of all this. You know what I didn't bring? Bottles. That's going to be a problem. Oh, that's actually around the breach. Rapid fuck. Fucking Shadow Man. Oh, that was Sachika. Alright, seems like we have to uh, bail as soon as we hear about giving birth. got a lot more help. Well, you know what? You guys might as well dress yourself. Let's take this. We need this, right? Might as well dress yourself out of the remains. That's how it's done. Let's take this. Literally stumbled in the street and the first thing here is a male saying the pain's giving birth. <laughs> 36 rounds left. She's still good. He's not on. Alright, that's our cue to get the fuck out. I'm going to keep an eye on that when he can't move. That's, that's getting a little... Okay, he's just kind of going nuts now. Apparently this is... Oh, no, you know, I'm not, I'm not even, I'm not, just, no. Shit. That was fun. Now I'm just fucking everything up. God, the ladies are way worse than the uh, the male ones for this fight. There's fucking more of them. Shit. Okay, well, did not backpedal enough for that. Hmm. I wonder if he's just going to keep spawning stuff now.
Maybe we could use this. I wonder, I wonder, I wonder. Shit. Excuse me, gotta pick that up. Fifty-five. Mm, still actually taking damage though. Oh, because they don't have the good armor on. Though if I don't have to carry the bullets, I'll grab the gun again in a moment. Maybe I can get away with it. I'm gonna have to test it. Fifteen's definitely better. Retreat would be a legitimate strategy right now. Not what I wanted to come down to. Concentrate. Yeah. In fact, if Rinko had a little bit more carry, I'd say this would be her job. Wait, I'm mostly immune to Sonic. My ears. Yep. Still immune enough. All right, Yuma using the Sonic, I think, is what's going to do it. Rest in peace. I need to find a restroom. That unfortunately is not happening. I need to. My ears. Retreat would be a legit I lose weight. And where's the other one? There we go. gonna wind up just being solo Yuma. I'm kicking myself for leaving the bottles behind for once. I never forget the bottles. This time I forgot the bottles. Go figure. Ooh, final boss. Maybe excessive green. Thank you for the bits, Bill, and yes. Something to that effect. Oops, not that many. Okay, sufficient. She can still keep the heavy stuff on. Oh, you know what? No one cares. Yeah. Fuck you, I'll stand right here. I can do with more pinpoint shots going off, though. One of them done. There we go. A few pinpoint shots. He's resistant to it, though, sadly. It's nice that we can just completely ignore the fire. I'm sure we're still not. I wonder how much health he has. Oh, 
retreat would be a legitimate strategy. There is no retreat. It's not a legitimate strategy. Shit. I went to step back, bumped into something. I might just go down to solo Yuma to maximize the potential damage from the assets we have left. Concentrate. That's it for the, uh, I think that's it for the ammunition, though. Concentrate. We still have the small gun. Are right, you need to come play with me. In the Sonic stuff. There you go. Damn, she's doing quite a job of getting through that. Is Mommy still alive? Nope, nope. All right, there is no one to, uh... Yeah. There's, there's no one to, uh, strategy. help when she inevitably... Yeah, she's gonna empty her bladder. Hey, fish rock. Still going, we're at the end, though. Yeah, we're gonna have to switch down to the bow. Because we're out of, uh... Well, not quite actually all ammo. We still have the uh, the handgun. Whoa, that is way stronger. The U Magnum is real. Is Sachika in that machine too? You Magnum? Extent Machine 1 Plus falls apart with a deafening rumble. The fluid leaking from the machine pools on the floor. Its volume steadily increasing. Well, there goes all my gear. So I really could have just soloed it with Yuma, is what that boils down to. Oh, did we win? Hey, show! You missed that last attack on purpose, didn't you? Did I? Didn't you show them your weak point on purpose earlier, too? <laughs> That's because Mirai loves them! <laughs> Me too. I didn't want to end up just being the doctor's puppet. Damn, you... The reason we're who we are is all thanks to Mamoru, so thank you! Even though our writing was pretty sloppy and our jokes missed the mark a bunch of times, Oh, ladies and gentlemen, please give me give me some salutes or Fs in chat. For showing Mirai. For being uh somehow a class act at the end. Okay, show. Let's say goodbye to them one last time. No. I want you to live at least. I'll buy you some time after we say bye-bye. Huh? I'll make the power hold out for a little longer. Use that time to find a way out. What? No! We should face the end together! Damn show. Oh, Mirai. You don't need to say that for me. We've already been through so much together. Okay, let's go. Illuminate! A, a brighter future! For humanity! Bye-bye! Go, Mirai! Leave the power to... Oh. That was quick! Sheesh, I didn't expect the AI to be this useless. Oh my god. <laughs> that is the most show thing this game has done. But you've surpassed my expectations. All the pain and death you've endured, 
has now paid off. It's over. I'm gonna pull that XT right out and arrest you. You'll pay for what you did. Stop. Dad, stop this, please. What's the point of killing each other now? Why, I'll become a god. The god of the new world. You cliche fuck. <laughs> Be quiet. And talk about all you want, but you're nothing more than scrap now. <laughs> oh no, Zen Kubota, my boy. You don't actually think this ends here, do you? Huh? Behold! Allow me to show you the new human. Born from the data you've all collected for me. I don't know that I have enough bullets left for this. What? What now? Now, Clara, take me in deeper into your womb and give birth to me. Can we not? Damn it. I do not have resources to continue this.